Hello, 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 hello. Welcome back to my channel. This is Luca Torrijani and today we're going to talk about how to be more productive and stop procrastinating. I have to admit, I was one of those kids at school that waited until the last second to do that book report and then scrambled at the last moment. Well, as procrastinators, we are underestimating the real time uh, that it takes us to do a project. And our brain also serves us, us easy rewards that protect us from something that is boring or difficult. So our brain says, have that cookie, and then you'll start the project. Or shop online a little bit, and then you'll start the project. And then you never do the project. <laughs> And sometimes it's even harder, at least I'm experiencing this as an entrepreneur, that when there's not a real deadline, then it's even harder because all the projects relies on your shoulder and you have to be your own motivator. So here's a couple of things that I've been trying to do to be more productive. First of all, I'm going to debunk this myth. Not every single thing that is in front of you has to be enjoyable. Simple as that. There are things on your to-do list that you have to do and there are, stop waiting it to be enjoyable. Show up on stage and deliver your line. It's that showtime mentality, it's showtime. No more excuses, just do it. But in order to do it, you gotta get excited. So instead of thinking about how hard it is going to be to do this, think about the end result. Visualize how you will feel when the project is completed. How happy would you feel when that room is clean, the laundry is done, the project is finished? And use that happy feeling, that energy, to get going. And in order to get going, it goes back to planning it. If it's not on the calendar, it's not going to happen. You go to the dentist because it's on your, on your calendar. So do that. Come up with a deadline if you don't have one or write down the real deadline, deadline of a project and then go backward from that. Set up a real timeline with manageable s steps so you can actually complete and do what you need to do. Now, what's in the way of you showing up the moment when the calendar says it is time to work? So are you the person that is going to just, you know, get your phone out and scroll for just five minutes on social media and then it's the entire afternoon. Well, if that's the case, take the phone away. Take away your distractions so that you can be more productive in the moment where it's time to work. And it's not about all or nothing, right? So celebrate successes. If you have through the project and you're doing well, eat that cookie. Do something that makes you feel happy and push the momentum forward. I'm confident that if you are a procrastinator and you create a real plan with the idea of what the end result is and you know the big picture, I am confident that you'll be more productive this year. Why don't you give it a try? Subscribe, comment, and ciao for now.